Hello everybody, Slim Kirby here, and welcome back to more Let's Play Sonic 3 and Knuckles. This will actually be a two-zone video, because the next two zones are incredibly short. In fact, both zones only have one act. I think it's because these zones were meant to have kind of a story purpose as far as a uh, gameplay purpose. So what do we have up here? Knuckles! Yeah, it looks like we're gonna be fighting Knuckles in this zone. Knuckles is not too hard to defeat. Just wait for him to do his little glide move and then jump at him. Whenever he does the spin dash, you have to be a little more careful. And you can also hit him when he's just standing there, too, but you have to be kind of careful there as well. But after a few hits, he goes down pretty easily. And what do we have over here? Hey, our Super Emeralds. And then Knuckles realizes that the whole time, Dr. Robotnik has been the enemy. Now, there is nothing you can do right here, and he's going to wipe out Knuckles, and there's nothing you can do about it. You can hit him up to 20 times, and it still doesn't really even matter. So, Knuckles is going to come to his senses, and he's going to actually help us out. It's about frickin' time. And that's it for Hidden Palace Zone. Next, we're going to move on to Sky Sanctuary Zone. In the background, we can see the Death Egg start to rise. He's going to send his soldiers out to destroy us. We need to find a way to catch it before it's too late. So come on, Knuckles, let's do this. And it's all us from here. This is actually where Knuckles' stories ends, believe it or not. So, we have to do our part and destroy Robotnik before it's too late. But first, we have to get through the Sky Sanctuary Zone. This zone's really cool. I, I've always kind of had a soft spot for this zone. It's not my favorite, but it's also just a really cool zone in general. I love that they brought this game, or this zone, back in Je Sonic Generations. I thought it was a beautifully rendition level in that game. Oh, pfft. I thought there was a bumper right there on one of those uh, sp launch springs. My bad, I guess not. Ooh, what do we... Okay, no, I thought that was a cloud we could jump on. There are clouds you can jump on in this zone. You just gotta know which ones you can jump on. Like these. What's this? Hey, you're not Robotnik. And this isn't Sonic 1. This is not Sonic 1. How dare you bring back memories of a game that we already beat. So, it looks like we have to take on uh, this Metal Sonic copy. I think it's supposed to be Mecha Sonic, not Metal Sonic. There's like so many different variations of Metal Sonic. There's, uh... You know, Metal Sonic, the true Metal Sonic, which was in Sonic CD. There's this, which is supposed to be Mecha Sonic. And, uh... There's also the one in Sonic 2, which I believe is Silver Sonic or something? God, I don't even remember his name, but... There's, like, so many different variations of a... Metallic Sonic clone that you can't even keep track of them anymore. Well, what's this now? No, this isn't Sonic 2 either. Game, you're drunk. Although I will admit, this is a lot easier than freaking Sonic 2 fight. So 
So what's next? You're gonna throw a Sonic 3 fight at us or something? Watch, that's totally what they're gonna do. That or they're just gonna not do it. Just to prove me wrong. It's not like I already know what's coming. <laughs> Ah! So many obstacles, so little time! Hey, those poor little chickens! Stop destroying their home! What do they ever do to you? Okay, let's get out of here. Or let's don't. Okay, so this fight isn't from uh, Sonic 3, but we do have a fight with this metallic beast. He can be kind of tricky if you aren't careful. He works kind of similar to the uh, silver Sonic fight in Sonic 2. But he's not really that hard. And that's going to do it for Sky Sanctuary. So, this has been Slim Kirby. I will see you guys next time for what might be the final zone of Sonic and Knuckles.